Hey, good morning, my friends. I got the um, border decals sealed, and it just looks like they're a part of the plane now. They seal up very well. See, you can barely see the carrier film. You have to get really in close. But with uh, a good lacquer sealer, they do, they blend in really nicely. Which is cool. So, um, I've got the propeller fixed up. So that got some black green on it. I think that's called Swartz Grun or something. So I've got that a little straighter, I suppose. We'll see what we can do with that. See if, if that looks good. Um, I suppose the next step will be to you know, get this painted. So we'll get this, you know, all sealed up and painted and all that. Got to um, cover the windows with liquid mask. Um, and then we'll start painting the details, hey? So we'll start painting the wheels and the wheel bay. Stuff like that, not many details to paint. But isn't it nice, like the details, when I really get washes into it and, and stuff, it's really going to bring it out. I'm just trying to think of um, some things to do with the top colours. But yeah, when we start bringing out all those beautiful border details, it'll look good. But yeah, once it's all together and painted, you can see all those build problems and, and all that stuff just wash away. It's a beautiful plane. They've done really well. Yeah, good stuff, border. Thank you. I pulled apart my hairbrush. It just wasn't doing the job anymore. It's just the older one I've got. So, but I've got this really nice eye water one. I put this together and um, it works like a dream. So I'm back into awesome airbrushing. So yesterday I was working on this. Um, so I put a little bucket on the back of the Panzer II with a, um, with a chain. And so that'll be a nice little detail as well. And that's starting to, you know, detail up good. It's really nice. It's a really nice little tank and I'm starting to get happy with it. And I did a lot of work on this. So we got the camo pattern sort of finished. And I started to add some uh, variation to the color of it as well. So bringing out the color of just the khaki. And what I did was I dry brushed lightly on this, this color here. And this is really handy color to have. There's a few Tamiya colors that you should really get that you can't do without. Like Buff is one of them. This is another one. Um, yeah, there's a few different ones. Wooden Deck Tan. That's a really important Tamiya color. Um, yeah, there's a few. Tamiya colors are really good. And I also started to get the tracks sorted out. So we'll start to um, do that. So I painted them black as, as the background color. And then I started to put some pigment, just a little rust pigment, dark rust pigment onto the, the tracks after the black. And then we can really start to detail this up. But it is, it's Academy have done really well with this Panzer. They're very detailed. I have to fix that. The chains have gone broken. I'll fix that now. But yeah, I'm really happy with it. The these are both repaints, so reconditions. Alright. Happy Sunday modeling and I'll see you again soon.